What's going on, Infinite Fam? Welcome back to another video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notification bell, leave a positive comment down below for a chance to get a chance to get a shout out in the next video. That is right, guys. So today, your boy is about a. I'm about to win my thousand dollars back. I can't no, believe I put up a thousand dollars. No, we need to explain to them what the okay, money is for, about. Let's explain to, to them money. that this is mine. This is mine. Okay. Not for so, long. Okay. <laughs> you're very confident. You're very confident. I am confident. You know what? Let's stop the talking and let's just tell them what's going on. So, guys, <laughs> I yesterday me and Janice got into like a little like disagreement. It wasn't like what? Let's stop the talking and let's tell them what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> they know what I mean, yo. Come on. So yesterday me and Janice got into like a little disagreement. Not like an argument or anything, but she asked me a question and I had got it wrong. And she was like, oh yeah, you don't know anything about me, you know, being like sarcastic. So I was like, you know what? I bet you could ask me anything. I bet you a thousand dollars I get all the questions right. So she was like, all right, let's make it into a game. Your boy went, got the thousand dollars. Okay, so now here's the rules. You have 10 questions, right? Yes, I do. For every question I get right, I take a hundred dollars back. Mm -hmm. For every question I get wrong, she takes a hundred dollars away from me. And whatever's left here in the pile, you get to keep. Period. So There's I not gonna be anything left. What do you mean? There's ten hundred dollar bills. That's a thousand dollars and ten questions. All them ten questions are gonna be right, which means all those ten hundred dollar bills are gonna be on this side. Let me just say this: I'll be very shocked if Isaiah knows these questions, like, and you answer them right. Bro, I've because, been with you for almost seven years. Yeah, but there's certain things that we just don't talk about often, you know. I know everything about you. All right. Well, let's see. Let's put it to the test. <laughs> I know the last time you had a bowel movement. Ooh. You be doing too much. See, that's your problem. Yeah. All right, anyway, let's get this video started. <sighs> All right, first and foremost, let me just say I'm very hyper today. So if I seem a little crazy, I'm in a giggly, fun, and goofy mood, okay? Get the questions going, bro. All right, so the first question is, how did I get the scar on my knee? You fell down the, oh, oh the knee? <laughs> um, yeah, 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 yeah. I thought you were yeah. gonna say the one on your back. I knew, I knew the one on your back. The one on your knee, you were riding your bike. Outside. Final answer. You were riding your bike and you fell outside. Wrong! You're such a liar. Wrong. How'd you get it? How'd you get it? How'd you get it? Wrong. How'd you get it? 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 I was running down the driveway on a it was on a slant on a hill and I busted my ass. Same <laughs> thing, you fell outside. No, bro, you said I was riding my bike. Alright, you know what? I think I deserve at least half. No! I deserve half. Imagine when he ripped it, I, I would have fought you. Who said anything about you? All right, you know what? You could have the hundred. Right, I'm taking it. Go I'm ahead. Yeah, whatever. I'm, uh, whatever. All Let's right. Do it. Next one is, if I could eat one thing for the rest of my life, what would it be? Pizza. Ooh, You're bro. such a liar. Wow, <laughs> bro. What? What would you eat for the rest of your life? Chicken tenders and fries. Are you kidding me? And as much as you love pizza and you say it all the time? Yeah, but pizza is like, I, I can't eat that all the time. What you is, know I have issues. You said if I could eat anything for the rest of my life, what would it be? Pizza. No, it wouldn't be. That's your favorite food. No, it's not. What's your favorite food? Chicken tenders and fries. Oh my god, you're just you're so basic for that. Wow. How am I basic? But when we go out to eat, all Isaiah gets is chicken tenders and fries. Stop exposing me. Oh no, but you calling me basic. Damn, bro, I'm down to 800. You're down bad. I'm down to 800. Bad. This is the, this is the utility bill right here. Damn, all right, keep it going. Yeah, see? He's talking about he's going to get all of them right. Look at him. Getting I'm all good. of them wrong. It's all right. I'm, I'm still, I still have a chance to win. All right, you got hope. I, I got hope in you with this one, okay? Let's go. What did I name my Mini Cooper and why? Oh, my God. Um, a two-parter, huh? The name started with a J. Okay, okay. Jenna. <laughs> You named it Jenna, and it was because it was from um, Vampire Diaries. Ah! I got it right. Yeah. Give me. Yes. That's a honey. I'm so proud of That's you. That's a honey. That's right. Of course, Isaiah would get a car question right. That's right. That's exactly why I put it in there. Because I was like, you know what? Let me make one at least easy for him. Hello, Mr. Benjamin. Get him some money. All right, next question. What's a job I've always wanted to do but was too scared to pursue? Don't get it wrong. Tattoo artist. That's another one, baby. Mr. Benjamin Franklin. Hello. Wow, I thought you were going to get that one wrong. I thought you were going to say acting, music. Nope, nope, nope. All right, so all right. Damn, how you know that? It's because I tweeted it the other day. When did you? I don't go on Twitter like that. You lying. I go on Twitter to look at memes and that's it. Mm, you, he lying. I'm dead serious. He was studying my page before don't this. Don't want to study your page. <laughs> Next question, bro. Okay, what was the first musical call that I did? Chicago? Final answer? 
It ain't that one. Um, uh, Phantom of the Opera. Final answer? Chicago. Which one is it? Ch Chicago. That's your final answer? That's Chicago. You wrong. <laughs> what is it? Technically, first musical ever I did was Annie, but if we're talking I high school, it's Celebration. Oh, I wouldn't have gotten any of those. Mm. Well, I had 200, now I'm down How much you know me. That's how much you know me. See? See what I mean? This is going to be an argument later. Okay. Next one is, what celebrity was I convinced that I'd marry one day? Like Bro, a, Justin Bieber. Final answer? Justin Bieber. You were like so like infatuated with him. You were like, yo, that's gonna be my husband. You had a life-size cutout of the kid. Is that your room. final answer? If that's the only answer. Well, it's wrong. What is it? Who? Harry Styles. You're such a liar, bro. Oh you were God. so more obsessed with Justin I Bieber. I literally had an I like Justin Bieber as an artist, but you I had Justin Bieber bed him. sheets. You had a cutout of him. But you had is, the hat. Okay. You had it all. But the thing is, I didn't want to marry him. I just wanted to be friends. Who? What else would you want to do with someone that you were like infatuated with? That like I, I admired his music. That doesn't mean I want. You to marry admired him. him. No, I didn't. Oh my God, bro. We are so, take a hundred. It was Harry Styles, and I have a note from 2013 that I will show you guys. And I said at this point or something like that, the only person I ever want to marry is Harry Styles, and I will show you to prove you that that's a correct answer. My boy Ben says cap. It's not cap. I will. Oh, I'm gonna post it. I'm gonna post it right here. Next question, bro. Next question is. This wait, is gonna be wait. Easy. I got that. You. I got that wrong, right? You took from here. Yeah. Oh no. So technically, no. You put this. You took one from here. Mm-hmm. No, you put that back. You're supposed to take mine. All right. So that's it. You broke. I am. Broke. All right. Next one is, what is my favorite genre of music? This one's easy. This one will get you your hundred back. <sighs> Jesus. Um. This. This. I swear, if it's wrong, bro. What is it? R and B. Final answer. R&B. You're not going to tell me that it's not R&B, bro. What, what are you going to say? What are you going to say? Let me hear it. You know I like my emo shit. You know I like my emo shit. Oh, actually, no. What am I talking about? I was going to say, you gave it to me, but yeah, you're trying to say I'm wrong? I don't No, you're wrong. Bro. All right, whatever. I'm so just you're gonna tell, it. You're going to tell me you listen to like rock and roll and like emo music way more than you do R&B? No, but my exactly favorite. Exactly what? Listen, my favorite kind of music. You see how she's cheating? How am I cheating? My favorite kind of music is emo music. What makes me happier? What I love I happier? love emo music too, like the rock and all that. But bro, you know dang well we listen to way more R&B. Yeah, but that's because I'm always in like a mellow mood. Oh it's just matching my energy. Next question. But if question. I want to be happy, Next I'm going to listen to my... Next Shit. question. And you know that. Next question. Oh my god. I can just imagine the face you made with that sound that you made. <laughs> oh All right. This one, I hope you get right. I have. I still have a chance to win what? One, two, three. I still have a chance to win 500. Okay. What pair of sneakers in my closet do I love the most? Out of all the sneakers you have, are you kidding me? I have a favorite and I told you. I told you once which ones my favorite. Are the ones you recently bought? I'm not giving you that. Okay, answer this at least. What? Are they designer sneakers or are they Jordans? Answer that at least. How? Answer that at least. Are they designer sneakers or are they Jordans? I can't tell you that. Bro, you gotta like help me out here, no, yo. You have way why? too many. Why? All right, um, I'm gonna go ahead with the... I'm gonna go with the, the white and yellow Jordan 3s that you barely wear because you can never find nothing to wear with them, but I'm gonna go with those. What is it, bro? What is it? I told you it's what is it? Say it. What is it? What is it? It's the Jordan ones, the blue and gray ones. The ones I white. bought? Yes, I told you. I'm like, these are my favorite ones that you got. Don't be lying and saying that I didn't say that. Because I was like, these are not my favorite shoes. I want to wear them all the time. I did say that. Yo, you was about to be brokey, brokey, bro, bro. Whatever. Whoa, next, whoa, next whoa. question, next question. Yeah, buffoonery? The only buffoonery is you not knowing me. Yeah, you don't know whatever, me. Whatever, bro. All right, next one is, what book did I feel connected to the most as a kid? And I told you this the other day, too. Perks of being a wallflower. How, bro? No. What are you going to say? Dr. Seuss, like, cat in a hat or something like that? What are you going to say? I told you. What, did you, what are you going to say? Green eggs and ham, what? No, it's a book called Wings. And I Wings? What the? I never even oh heard of you God. speak of that. I literally said this is the first book that I read 
front to back in seventh grade. I didn't even hear you talk about that book. Because you weren't paying attention to me. Oh, my God. I told you that I remember it from uh, front to back, that she had wings growing from her back, and she was oozing all this stuff because she was turning into a fairy. I told you. I told you that. That's my favorite book. You didn't tell me shit. Yes, I did. Oh, my God. Next question, bro. I got $300, bro. All right. This is a lot of BS going on. What's BS is you it's not knowing BS. me. Let's, let's go. All right, next one is, what piece of jewelry can I not live without? Your rings. That one's a fact and we could fight over this one. What are you gonna say? Dude, I, if I don't have earrings on, I feel naked. Your e My hoops, my hoops. Bro, when you wear you rings more than earrings? anything. You wear rings more than anything. Yeah, but like, I can't live without Yo, my I'm earrings. Yo, I'm starting to think this is rigged. How is it right? Because you're you're like switching up answers. I've never I'm heard of this. Switching up answers. I've never heard of this. You wear rings more than anything. Dude, ever since I was nine years old, I wore hoop earrings. Like hoops? Every single Studs? day. I don't care. You just wear rings nonstop. It's rings. I'm so disappointed. Next question. I'm down to 200. All right, guys, so we had to make a quick cut because um, we thought we ran out of questions. Turns out Janice already asked all her 10 questions. That last question was the last question. Mm -hmm. um, and the rules of the game was whatever was left here, she gets to have. So there you go, Janice. Way to go. I want to say that this game was BS and that I got two right. Actually, I want to say I got like four right. But technically, I did get two right because I had $200. But He's every, time a lie. I got, every time I got one wrong, you wanted to deduct it from me. So He's that's why lie. I'm broke. So here so you go, here's a thousand dollars, have fun, don't spend it all in one place. <laughs> Maybe you can buy yourself another pair of like favorite shoes or some hoop earrings. Mm. I'm gonna buy myself a ring. I, yo, boxing gloves, where are they? Where are they, are they in the closet? <laughs> are they in the closet? Yeah, probably. I'm about to grab them, yo, all right, hold on. We're gonna end this video right here. Your boy's about to go get the boxing gloves. We're about to do a part four to this boxing video because yo, I'm getting tired of this. What is it, part four or part I'm three? I'm not faced on this. It's part three we gotta do for the boxing video. Anyway. It is now time for today's post notification shout out. Today's post notification shout out goes out to Nicholas by you. Shout out to you, bro. Thank you so much for the love and support. If you guys want a post notification shout out, all you guys got to do is like, comment, share, and subscribe. Turn those post notification bells on so you're notified whenever we post a new video. And also, let me know if you guys play this game because this is honestly a great way to take money from your man. But anyway, we'll catch you in the next banger. He think he's slick. Bye.